Uh, can we welcome up our first poet of this section, uh, Emma Kemp, please? Hi. <laughs> um, good evening. And there's a, there's a little note I need to tell you. So uh, you've got to be old enough to um, remember in old cars, the old kind of cigarette lighters. Uh, so where it says here, a nichrome coil pressed to a 12 volt socket. That's what I'm talking about. It's called a warning to myself not to entertain your preliminary advances. I buckle on the edge of myself, my virtue, your passenger seat, some unholy unknown taught between us. Your skin is ash the thin blue off the instrument panel, my cheeks flushed in the dark, keyed up. You tell me that you are hard as regards rejection, given to press on in the face of defeat. I can believe that. I can believe you would impress yourself upon me. I can believe you leave a mark. Think back. You smothered yourself in plastic irony. Admit you are untrue as Coventry blue. Admit inside that plastic shell you are spring loaded, a nichrome coil pressed hard to a 12 volt socket. On charge, not blue, but blaze red. You must know by now I am bone dry as summer brush, as tinder. Would you like me to tear you out of yourself so you can enjoy us destroy each other? I wonder how much fire it would take to separate you into your fractions. Not a lot, my dear, not while I am feeling all prodigal. I could insist upon you, light you up, draw down bitumen from your contempt and naphtha from your audacity. Perhaps we would get high on what was left. I imagine that I can distill you and live happily alongside some residual, fragile goodness. You say, I want better. I say, you want to forget yourself. I suspect you already have. I cannot take part in your remembering. Know this, you do not want me the way you think you do. See here, I can unbuckle, I can exit. I can take my dry bones elsewhere. I can wish you very well.